In this podcast episode, Dr. Peter Atia, a renowned physician specializing in longevity and health optimization, shares his insights on aging, health metrics, and the importance of proactive measures to enhance life quality. The conversation delves into various subjects, each shedding light on critical aspects of health and longevity that are often overlooked. Dr. Atia begins by addressing a fundamental truth. Death is inevitable, but the rate of decline leading up to it is largely within our control. He emphasizes that many young people only begin to grasp the reality of aging when they experience its effects firsthand. This realization often comes too late, as they may ignore early signs of decline that could be addressed through lifestyle changes. He points out that individuals in their 20s often overlook health issues that, if left unaddressed, could lead to significant problems later in life. The conversation highlights the importance of early intervention and awareness. Dr. Atia encourages listeners to take charge of their health proactively, rather than waiting for symptoms to manifest. By understanding the inevitability of decline and taking steps to mitigate its effects, individuals can significantly improve their quality of life as they age. Dr. Atia introduces the concept of the marginal decade, which refers to the last decade of life when many individuals experience a decline in their physical capabilities. He recounts a personal epiphany he had at a funeral, where he observed a friend who had declined significantly in their later years. This experience led him to realize that many people retreat from life when they can no longer engage in activities that bring them joy due to physical limitations. To combat this decline, Dr. Atiyah advocates for specific training and preparation for the marginal decade. He believes that just as athletes train for their respective sports, individuals should train for the physical demands of aging. By focusing on maintaining strength, mobility, and endurance, people can enhance their quality of life and continue to engage in activities they love well into their later years. When discussing the most important aspects of health for longevity, Dr. Adia emphasizes muscle mass and strength. He notes that while there is no single metric that can predict longevity, muscle mass and strength are among the best indicators. He explains that individuals with higher muscle mass and strength tend to have better health outcomes and lower mortality rates. Dr. Adia also introduces the concept of VO2 max, which measures the maximum amount of oxygen a person can utilize during intense exercise. He explains that a higher VO max is associated with better cardiovascular health and longevity. The stark contrast between individuals in the top 2% of max compared to those in the bottom 25% reveals a staggering 400% difference in all-cause mortality over the coming year. This statistic underscores the importance of cardiovascular fitness in promoting a longer, healthier life. To prepare for the marginal decade, Dr. Atia stresses the need for targeted training. He believes that individuals should focus on exercises that enhance strength, mobility, and endurance. He draws parallels between the training regimens of athletes and the training needed for aging individuals. Just as athletes tailor their training to their specific sports, older adults should tailor their training to the physical demands they will face in their later years. Dr. Atia encourages listeners to start training early as the sooner one begins, the better the outcomes will be. He emphasizes that strength training should be a priority, as it not only helps maintain muscle mass, but also supports overall health and functional capacity. By investing in their physical fitness now, individuals can significantly improve their quality of life as they age. As the conversation progresses, Dr. Atia shares what currently fascinates him in his work. He discusses his efforts to translate the concepts from his book, Outlive, into a digital delivery system that makes it easier for individuals to implement the solutions for themselves. He is passionate about helping people live longer, healthier lives, and is dedicated to finding ways to operationalize the science behind longevity. Additionally, Dr. Atia highlights his interest in training individuals for their marginal decade. He believes that preparing for this phase of life is crucial and that people should be comfortable discussing the realities of aging. By addressing these topics openly, individuals can better prepare themselves for the challenges that lie ahead. Dr. Atia introduces the concept of the centenarian decathlon, 
which he describes as a framework for thinking about the physical capabilities one wants to maintain in their later years. He encourages listeners to envision the activities they want to be able to do when they reach their marginal decade and to train specifically for those activities. This approach emphasizes the importance of setting clear goals and working towards them through targeted training. The centenarian decathlon serves as a motivational tool, prompting individuals to consider what they value most in life and how they can maintain the physical capacity to enjoy those experiences. By focusing on the activities that bring joy and fulfillment, individuals can create a roadmap for their health and fitness journey. One of the surprising metrics discussed is grip strength, which Dr. Atia explains is a strong predictor of longevity. He notes that grip strength is not only indicative of overall strength, but also correlates with various health outcomes. Individuals with stronger grips tend to have better health and lower mortality rates. Dr. Atia emphasizes the importance of maintaining grip strength as a key component of overall fitness. He suggests incorporating exercises that target grip strength into one's training regimen as this can have a significant impact on long-term health and functional capacity. As the conversation shifts to the effects of aging on muscle mass, Dr. Atia highlights the importance of maintaining muscle throughout life. He explains that muscle mass naturally declines with age, leading to increased frailty and a higher risk of injury. This decline can significantly impact an individual's quality of life and ability to engage in daily activities. To combat this decline, Dr. Adia advocates for regular strength training and a focus on protein intake. He encourages individuals to prioritize their muscle health and to be proactive in their training efforts. By doing so, they can mitigate the effects of aging and maintain their independence and vitality as they grow older. Nutrition plays a crucial role in longevity, and Dr. Adia emphasizes the importance of a balanced diet rich in essential nutrients. He discusses the significance of protein intake, particularly for those looking to maintain or build muscle mass. He suggests that individuals should aim for a specific protein target based on their body weight to support their health and fitness goals. In addition to protein, Dr. Atia highlights the importance of micronutrients, such as vitamins and minerals, in supporting overall health. He encourages listeners to be mindful of their dietary choices and to prioritize whole, nutrient-dense foods that promote longevity and well-being. Dr. Atia concludes the conversation by discussing the critical role of sleep and stress management in overall health. He explains that poor sleep can lead to a host of negative health outcomes, including increased inflammation and insulin resistance. By prioritizing sleep and managing stress effectively, individuals can significantly improve their health and longevity. He encourages listeners to adopt healthy sleep habits and to be mindful of their stress levels. By taking proactive steps to improve sleep quality and reduce stress, individuals can enhance their overall well-being and set themselves up for a healthier future.